we are moisturized today. Hello YouTube fam, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alyssa Marie, just in case you are new. Before we get started today, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. It will help me out tremendously and also, I feel like we have a lot of fun here so you won't regret it, I promise. Today I will be going over my special routine that I like to do when I need to bring my curls back to life, like back from the dead. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Your hair is frizzy, dehydrated, maybe a little heat damage or a little color damage and it's just in need of some love and attention. I'm showing y'all everything. So this is something that I tend to do like bi-weekly. This is not like my regular weekly wash day, which you guys have watched on here multiple times. But this is something that takes it one step further. Like it's a little bit more intense and we're really focusing on putting more moisture back into our curls. Basically, I'm showing you my little tips and tricks and favorite products to keep my hair popping, bouncy, healthy, shiny, happy. And I'm gonna stop talking now so we can get started. All right, so I am starting with some really crazy, dehydrated, weak old hair. Like my hair, let's get a little close up. It's just on the struggle bus right now and I can kind of tell that it needs a little, little bit of extra TLC today. And when my hair needs TLC, I make sure that I go in with a pre-treatment. So before we jump into the shower and start cleansing or anything like that, we're gonna go in with our pre-treatment for the day. My current favorite is the Olaplex number three at home treatment. Olaplex is life. It's actually amazing for any hair type at all. So if you have any type of damage, any type of anything wrong with your hair, if you colored it, you got heat damage, anything really, if you're struggling with your hair, this bad boy does some wonders. And because my hair is colored now, I really rely on my Olaplex treatment to make sure that my hair just stays in check and stays as healthy as it possibly can. One thing I want to mention about Olaplex is the rest of their products do have silicones in it. The number three treatment doesn't, so this is why that's the one I recommend. But I don't want you to then think, oh, this is so good, let me try everything else. They have silicones, so I wouldn't suggest you try anything else other than the number three treatment. So basically this is just meant to be applied to towel dried hair. So what I do is I start with my dry hair and then I will wet it up in the sink a little bit. Then I'll towel dry it and then apply it in sections as I comb it through with my fingers. Depending on the amount of damage you have in your hair is how often you're going to use this. So it says that you can use it once per week regularly if you just have a little bit of damage or like me if you have colored hair that you're just trying to maintain. Otherwise, if you have more serious damage in your hair, then you can use this up to two to three times per week. So when you're using Olaplex, you want to use a generous amount. Like I use a lot each time. It's the only annoying thing is that the bottle is so small, right? So you kind of want to savor it but honestly you should really just use a generous amount every time i know it's annoying i really really want them to come through with a much bigger bottle that would make my life a lot easier but yeah for me i just prefer to use a lot <laughs> i'm just gonna add a little bit extra directly to my ends middle part of my hair gets so dry so quickly so I'm gonna grab my little spray and kind of make sure that it's damp definitely putting a little extra extra in this middle piece here oh did I mention that this is amazing slip oh this is like a great pre step to cleansing and conditioning your hair as well because your hair will already be nice and detangled All right, so that is it. I kind of made sure that I continued like smoothing it and combing it through my curls until the curls were nice and smooth. Like I have minimal frizz right now, which is good. All right, so my hair is fully soaked with this treatment. The bottle says that you should leave it in there for 10 minutes minimum, but I think I'm gonna stretch it to about 30. And then I will be back in my shower to show you guys the rest. All right, so I've just fully washed out all of the Olaplex and now we're gonna get into some cleansing. So for cleansing today, I am gonna use the Built Up Buster by Diva Curl. Actually, all of the products that I use from here on out are actually gonna be Diva Curl. They're my favorite 
to use when my hair just needs a little pick me up it's just a brand that i trust and they don't have any sulfates parabens silicones nothing in their products so i know that i can 100 percent trust all of their products to give my hair exactly what it needs so build the buster is only something that i use maybe like once a month it is a super super deep cleanse i have spoke about it in a few of my other videos i love it but when i find that my hair is like not behaving it's a little bit frizzy and it just needs like a little bit of extra tlc i love to use my build up buster just because i like it to kind of just reset my hair it literally gets everything out of your hair which is why i don't use it more than once a month but it's like a really great reset if you feel like you've used products in your hair that you shouldn't have used and your hair's just not agreeing with it and you just need to start from scratch and just get everything completely cleansed out of your hair this is what i love to use all right so i've just sectioned my hair in two and basically i'm just going to go ahead and apply it i'm going to re-wet my hair though to make sure it's nice and soaking wet and then kind of just focus it mainly on my scalp and then kind of bring it down from my scalp to the rest of my hair. All right, so that is all done and applied throughout my whole scalp and my hair. Oh my gosh, do you guys see this length? Okay, so now I'm just gonna go ahead and rinse this out fully. Whew, all done, we are all nice and clean. Oh, I just love the Build Up Buster because as y'all know, I don't use shampoo. If you wanna find out why, I will tag that somewhere up here because I did a video on that as well. But I just love it because it's a safe way to get a super deep cleanse in your hair and my scalp. Oh, my scalp just always feels amazing after I use it. All right, so with that being said, because we've kind of like stripped our hair of everything, I always, always love to deep condition whenever I use my Build Up Buster. So today I'm gonna mix the Heaven and Hair Mask with the Melt Into Moisture Mask and really put some goodness back into these curls. <laughs> these are my two favorite masks from Diva Curl. I love them and whenever I wanna take my deep conditioning to the next level, I like to mix them together and y'all are about to see the kind of magic that happens. For those of you who don't know what a hothead is, this is something, it has like little beads in it, and it's something that you can stick into the microwave, heat it up, and then apply it while you're deep conditioning, like I have right now, and it allows for heat to be added to the process. And so what this does is the heat actually encourages your hair shaft to open up, and then all those nutrients from the treatment we have in here can like really get in to the hair. So I'm gonna leave this in for another 30 minutes, and then I will be back to quickly show you guys how I'm gonna style, and then that's it. Ta-da! All right, so now it is time to style. I'm just gonna kind of go through this part really quickly. You guys have seen me style my hair tons of times, and that's really not major point of this video so i'm just gonna go ahead and wash this out not fully as y'all know i like to leave a little bit in and then to style i'm gonna use my super cream and archangel gel both by deeper curl All right, so all my styling products have been applied. My hair is still dripping wet, so I'm gonna go ahead and diffuse off camera, get a little cute, and then meet you back in the studio for my final notes. Ta-da! Here is the look. My hair is probably like 90% dry, and it is feeling fluffy and soft and just moisturized. Oh. Guys, I swear by my routine. Like, this is the way that I go about reviving my curls when they need it. So I would say that I try and do this specific, like, regimen maybe bi-weekly or once a month if I'm being really bad. But my curls actually kind of like a big pick-me-up every two weeks. I really feel like the combination of the pre-treatment plus the super deep cleanse plus the heated super deep treatment was like a match made in heaven 
and my curls are just so happy and bouncy. Even my little dry patch in the back here, like it, it just, it doesn't feel like a dry patch right now. I swear by all of the products that I use today. But yeah guys, that is it for this video. I really, really hope you found this useful. If you have any additional questions, just go ahead and comment them below. I'm really, really trying to do better about, if not responding to every comment, acknowledging every single comment. So go ahead and ask away. If you enjoyed this as usual, please go ahead and give your girl a thumbs up. And also, don't forget to subscribe if you are liking the kind of content that you see. In the meantime, I'm gonna leave another few videos here for you to keep watching. Just binge, it's fine, I won't judge you. Thanks so much for watching guys, I will catch you in the next one, bye.